Hi, this is the July Lioness. Thank you for very much for coming and watching. This is Choco Chat for Saturday, May 16th, 2015. <sighs> so uh, yeah, I'm back out here on my little porch area. I like it out here. It doesn't get too noisy. It can get a bit noisy with people firing up their lawnmowers and sometimes traffic and stuff like that. So anyway, I got my list. This is just a weekly update. I don't think you guys are interested in watching me more than once a week. <laughs> uh, at least as a, in a vlog capacity. So anyway, uh, yeah, I've gotten my second channel going. It's called July Lioness Fun and Games. Uh, I have got couple of videos on there. I've got three older videos of the new bold ladies and then I've got two new videos. One is a spore let's play which is sort of a it was sort of a tester uh, but I'll keep it there. It's just a, like a 15 minute video. That's short. Uh, and then the other one is a City Skylines Let's Play. And that's, they're both introductory episodes and you both get to know the, the hostesses. So you the Spore one, you haven't, I haven't introduced the hostess yet, but on the City Skylines I have. And I, I hope you'll enjoy them. I hope if you like video games, you should enjoy them. Um, let's see. Sunday, I wasn't feeling too well. But I'm better now. You know, people, we just get our, have our ups and downs, especially once you get past 40. I don't know, weird stuff starts coming in, you know. Uh, let's see what else. Um, okay, yeah, I'm a Stampin' Up! independent demonstrator, and um, I have news of the new catalog. New catalog's coming out June 2nd, so that's like two weeks. So, if you guys are interested in a copy of the new catalog, please let me know. I'll mail one to you. Also, I have a website which I, um, I always link at the end of my videos in the credits. I give the, the URL to my website and that's got all my stuff on it. All, this, all about the books and everything. So definitely visit that if you want to know more about little old me. <laughs> and let's see. Um, I had someone, another YouTuber, very nicely mention my two books in one of her videos recently. And uh, yeah, I can give you, I'll make a note to link that so you can watch. Um, There's a picture of me in my books, and she shows that on screen, so you should be able to figure out that it's me. <laughs> she refers to me as one of her subscribers, so I think you'll figure it out. It's about, oh, halfway into the video, something like that. But her name is Miss Vicki B. I don't, you might be familiar with her videos, and she does a lot of, um, She's one of like a, a planner gal, girl, as they call themselves. So, she's a nice lady. I sent her copies of my books and she said she'd be happy to mention them in a video. So, they're kind of neat. It's getting the word out, you know? That's the whole thing, is getting the word out. Uh, I've been working on a bulletin board project which keeps morphing. <laughs> it was going to be a bulletin board, but then it's now it's just, I think it's just a painting. Um, I don't have it with me, I forgot to get it, but I'll show you. I'll, I'm, I am making a video of it, and so watch for that video. 
But what I did was there was a an old picture frame with um, just regular cardboard backing. I think it had been for posters or something. And I had a, um, I think somebody had a poster on it, but it was just cardboard and a wooden frame. And I thought it might make a good bulletin board, but it's kind of flimsy for that. So I bought some gesso and I painted it, the whole thing, this nice clean white with gesso. And then I took a stencil and I took some ink with some water down a little bit in these little spritzers and I spritzed ink through the stencil and pulled it off and it looks it looks really pretty. So then I had sort of a I ended up with kind of a grayish greenish background with the white of the, of the gesso coming through where the stencil was. And I've just been coloring it coloring it in and trying to figure out what else I'm going to do with the rest of it. So um, it's interesting. It's be proving to be a little more difficult than I had thought, but uh, I like it. It's it's just a painting for my bedroom. But uh, yeah, I will give you. I'll put the link in. I haven't actually finished making the video yet. I'm waiting for more supplies. I got ordered some stuff from Stampin' Up, uh, in, which included some stencils and some stamps and things and things I might add to this painting. We shall, uh, so I'm waiting to see if that's going to work out. It's starting to get a little noisy around here. I'm almost done. Um, what else? But yeah, it's, I'm looking forward to getting it to a point where I like it. I'm liking it more. I made it too dark. That's the problem. When you go too dark, it's very hard to come back. I could poss <coughs> possibly put some watered down bleach in the spritzer and spritz it on the dark. That probably would lighten it up so it would look like, you know, snowflakes or something. But I might save that. The stencil is of flowers, a cluster of flowers. It's really pretty. So the last thing, <laughs> this is kind of funny. I've been, you know, watching a lot of gamers on YouTube. My favorite, I probably mentioned him, is an Englishman named Biffa. And he, yesterday he didn't have a lot. He didn't upload a lot that was interested me very much. He really likes Minecraft, and I'm not, not real interested in Minecraft. So I was looking around for other gamers and I found a couple of, of female gamers and I thought, well, that'll be interesting. So I watched one and she found this really kind of interesting game about a, a, like a nature type game with about a lynx who has cubs and it's called um, Shelter 2. So I was watching her narrate shelter too and oh didn't like it at all i mean not the game the game looked all right not terrific graphics but you know it was fine but she was so annoying oh, like loud really loud and making stupid remarks like stating the obvious and like really like really obnoxious and I watched about five minutes of that and thought okay moving on <laughs> not my thing so I went and found some another one playing the same game <clears throat> also female and she was just as obnoxious I mean you know being really just I don't know why these people, you know, feeling like she has to entertain and not the game. It's 
you know, let the game speak for itself, you know, instead of, uh, ugh, uh, you know, you have to work with the game and let it make, you know, become, you're, you're there to, to, like, supplement the game, to offer any explanation that might be necessary, or maybe there's something that needs to be read aloud. I mean, you're not the star. You're, you're enhancing the game. And I think these people think that they're the stars because they're just <clears throat> garrulous, talking for talking's sake, no thought before speaking. I encounter that more and more too. It just, it's like, it makes me think of Douglas Adams um, in Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy. There's some part about people who just, just talk because if they don't talk, then their, their mouth is going to seize up and their brain is going to like explode or <laughs> I mean, it's just talking for talking's sake. I, and I also think of Monty Python. Let me tell you something. Oh, I just want to say this. Well, y'all, yeah, you talk and you talk, you Americans. Well, you're dead now, so shut up. <laughs> <clears throat> that was from The Meaning of Life, and that's not an exact quote. But <laughs> that's kind of what goes through my mind when I just hear these people just stating the obvious. Oh, it's a tree. Good. Oh, a kitten. How cute. That was just so loud. I'm not, I don't think I could even get that loud. <laughs> so, um, maybe I can show people how it's done. I hope I know the proper way. And Biffa does such a wonderful job with it, you know. But I guess I just, maybe because I'm older, I go for, you know, understatement and things like that. Okay, enough from me today. Nice of you to come and visit. Thank you very much. And I um, hope you'll come back in next week and visit again. And in the meantime, you can watch. I have other videos you could watch. Go check out the gaming channel. I think we're going to have some fun with that. Um, I'm going <clears> to <throat> record a couple episodes this weekend. So have a wonderful weekend, guys, and I'll catch up with you again soon. Thanks for stopping by. This has been the July Lioness. So long.